Mind your decisions, I'm Presh Talwalkar. A rectangle has a side length equal to 10. Construct two semicircles as shown, where each semicircle has a diameter equal to the side length of the rectangle. Inscribe a circle in the rectangle that's tangent to the two sides whose lengths are equal to 10 and goes through the two intersection points of the two semicircles. The question is what is the area of the region that's overlapping between the two semicircles? Pause the video if you'd like to give this problem a try, and when you're ready, keep watching to learn how to solve this problem. Since the side length of the rectangle is equal to 10, each of the semicircles will have a radius that's equal to 5. Now construct a radius between the center of the semicircle and one of the intersection points. Do the same thing for the other intersection point. Each of these radii will have a length equal to 5. Now consider the inscribed circle. We will construct a diameter of this inscribed circle. Since this is a diameter of the inscribed circle, we must have the angle that's inscribed opposite will be a 90 degree angle. Thus, we have a right triangle where two of its legs are equal to five. We will now be able to calculate the required area. Notice this shape is a sector of the semicircle and it has a central angle equal to 90 degrees. Thus, its area will be equal to one quarter that of the entire circle. So its area will be equal to pi r squared all over four, and here r is equal to five. So you have pi multiplied by five squared all over four. We will then subtract the area of this right triangle where two of its legs are equal to five. The area of this right triangle is equal to five times five all over two. The result will be equal to this shape, which is one half of the area that we want to calculate. We'll write this out. Then to get the entire area of the overlapping region, we need to double this area. So we add this area to itself and we get exactly the area of the shape that we want. This simplifies to be 12.5 pi minus 25, which is approximately equal to 14.27. And that's the answer. Thanks for making us one of the best communities on YouTube. See you next episode of Mind Your Decisions, where we solve the world's problems one video at a time.